How's it going everyone? It's Abdali here, bringing you guys another awesome Yokai Watch 2 Tips and Tricks video. This time, we're gonna show you guys how to get Snartle within Yokai Watch 2 Bony Spirits and Fleshy Soul. So, if you guys are excited to go through and battle one of the toughest wild yokai in the game, definitely smash that like button. Now, I still remember the days of playing Yokai Watch 1 where I would go through carelessly crossing the street and uh, out of nowhere, I would get wrecked by Snartle. But now, we've gone through and we've ranked up our S rank Yokai Watch, so we're as powerful as we can get. In order to avoid going through and crossing the street the wrong way, you can easily go through and press the button, or just stay away from all of the side streets in general. Don't even go on that crosswalk. Just go like above the crosswalk or below the crosswalk and you won't even have to worry about it. So anyway, before we even go through to fighting Snartle and attempting to befriend him, we need to be pumped up because we're gonna go get some marbled beef. Marbled beef is like the most expensive food out there. So if you guys can afford to, you're going to need this food. Of course, you can go through and try with some beef tongue and you'll probably get lucky with it. Beef tongue's only like, what, 10 bucks? Whereas like the marbled beef from Frank over here in Shopper's Row is a whopping 180 bucks. Holy moly. Of course, you can find some of them all throughout your playing through of the game. Uh, to save some money, go for it, but of course, Spending 180 bucks is pretty huge. So again, Beef Tongue could work, it's only $5.50. But anyway, with Snartle, how he works is that he gets stronger the higher your Yokai Watch rank is. So if you go through at the very beginning of the game and you grind all your Yokai before ranking up your Yokai Watch, you can go through and befriend Snartle very, very early on in the game, and he will totally be a Yokai that you're never gonna replace because he's that good. Of course, once you rank up your watch, he's going to be incrementally tougher. Once he's at uh, the S rank, or not, he's always at S rank, but once you're at the S rank watch, he will be the toughest in the entire game. So that's exactly what we're showing you right over here. I'm gonna go through and purposefully ride through the intersection and attempt to summon him all the way through. So here we go. Um, I like to go through in the area right next to the bank because there's an IPO really close next door. So this is my favorite spot in order to hunt for him. So now, here we have it, Snartle. His ability is exactly like Jibanyan's, where if he does KO someone, he's going to get a boost in his strength. So you need to be very, very wary about your yokai health, because at the same time, if he KOs one of your yokai, it's just going to be a snowball effect. He's going to be so much stronger, and then he's going to KO the next one, KO the next one, KO the next one, you're going to be gone before you know it. So anyway, I like to bring an Inspirator. Darknyan was the best person to bring to this, because Darknyan's in spirit goes through and lowers all of Snartle's stats. And that is amazing because instead of doing like 50, 60, 70 damage, he's like doing 40 or something like that. So here we go, go through and hopefully if you have a yokai that can do in spirits consistently with a cruel attitude, uh, you can keep on going through and in spiriting him. And then every time your yokai hits uh, Snartle, you'll get even more soul back, which allows you to go through and do even more soul ultimate moves. So anyway, uh, I almost forgot to throw the marbled beef over at him because that is his favorite food, of course. And of course, I've got Superstar Schmoopy in the back row that's totally helping out with this, by the way. So of course, don't forget to go through and poke as well, as once you get his negative in spirit going, poke him and go from there. But of course, I was lucky enough to get a heart out of a wisp. We're gonna go through over here, do another soul to it. And of course, we're gonna poke him too. So everything is lining up in this run for Snartle. It's amazing, I love this so much. And we're doing so much work to him, but he's got so much health. So anyway, so we've gone through and successfully poked him. We've successfully given him his favorite food, top tier. We've seen a wisp that popped out hearts. We've got the superstar soul. We've got Schmoopy. And at the same time, we're gonna finish him off with a soul ultimate move. Right here, Gutsy Crosspaw. This is gonna be, or Gusty Crosspaw. This is it, done. We finished him off with all those things. The only thing that could have been better is if we'd gotten a Golden Wisp with hearts on it. This was so amazing. Schmoopy, I believe in you. You're the greatest. Boom, right there, ladies and gentlemen. Snartle approaches you. Now, you can do this an infinite amount of times. And I highly suggest that. There's gonna be some bosses out there where you may need a row of Snartle. Snartle. 
Just saying, if you're able to go through and befriend multiple Snartles, I would totally have like a back row all of Snartles and just go through and wreck the entire game with it. So here's Matt, Blue Mask, Porky Pin. Yeah, some interesting names for him, but uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm very excited for this Snartle. He's a very good yokai for starters, and I'm definitely going to be using him against the final boss uh, once I find some time to go through and raise him up. Of course, with x -borbs. But anyway, as you guys can see, he's at level 69 right here because we have the S-rank watch, and that's the strongest Snartle that you're going to fight. So anyway, sword hunting increases the power every time you defeat a foe. Of course, lightning slash is going to be what you're going to be using. His technique attack is decent, ice, and then of course he's got a negative in spirit. So that means that you can go through and boost his speed up even further with the cruel personality. Of course, for Naughty Brats, we've seen his soul ultimate before. It's pretty intimidating. So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, a way, an easy way that you guys can go through and get your very own Snartle. And if you guys can get him at the beginning of the game, you guys are going to be set. Anyway, this yokai visits home asking, any brats here? It's a way of scaring kids into behaving well. Kind of like a reverse Santa. <laughs> Oh, I love that concept, like a reverse Santa. Anyway, so we're going to go through, we took a look at his medallion entry. Here is what his metal looks like. That looks pretty cool. You can see in the background that there is a stoplight. And I love that they just included that into the, uh, the little uh, animation of that. So yeah, Snartle and Shogunyan are going to be some top tier yokai, especially for online competitive battle and fighting the final boss within the game so i implore you guys to go through if you guys can afford some marble beef do it but make sure you guys save before you use it because you don't want to waste that 180 bucks that would be very bad so anyway guys that's snartle thank you guys so much for watching uh, a lot of you guys requested me to do a snartle tutorial so there you have it if you guys have any other suggestions as to other tutorials you would like to see let me know in the comment section below and i will get working on those right away so stay tuned to even more of them you guys can take a look at the playlist over here to be updated on all the latest and greatest of course new episodes over here and some recommendations there support your favorite youtuber abdallah smash by wearing some very cool abdallah merch by clicking over there and we're gonna be all set for this episode i'm pumped up that worked out so well <laughs> if imagine if i got a golden wisp on that that would be ideal that would have been so good anyway we'll see you guys in the next yokai watch 2 tips and tricks video bye